Let's go by official way of YouTube introduction. How's it going again, everybody? My name is Bear, and this is the Daily Challenge run for September 10th, 2013. Speak now, forever hold your peace. You want to bring the Daily Challenge with us tonight. Of course, yesterday's run went pretty damn well. Ended up taking 11th place overall on the leaderboards. But we have the choice now of, uh, ooh, Colin Northway, I was thinking about. I can't believe I called him Colin Firthway yesterday. I'm a big, big idiot. <laughs> there's, there's Bear Bots. Never gonna get old robot pick. God dang it, Bearbot. Oh, uh, now uh, he's influencing everybody. Oh my goodness. You can't pick four people. Good lord. Goldless. Goldless tre- Ooh, no treasure daily challenge. <laughs> Ooh, the Vi you know the Viking actually is a fantastic idea because that's a fitting character for later on. I think I'm gonna have to go with the Viking. Because we are going to be streaming uh, the Volgar kind of little preview thing that I'm going to have going on. Volgar the Viking, brand new game from, uh, I believe it's something like Viking Studios. I mean, I think they very well could have been created exclusively to make this game, so I suppose we'll find out more about that later. But for now, it's the Lucky Daily Challenge time. Of course, I'm going to be going for a uh, relatively high score today, I think. I felt kind of... Uh, Felt like I cheated myself out of a lot of money, a lot of potential for money at least last time. And I'd like to uh, make up for that a little bit today by attempting to grab as much- Oh my goodness, this is a terrible start, isn't it? Suppose I could just bomb down there, then I have to use another bomb. That's a bad idea, bad, bad idea. I'd rather use two ropes, I suppose. Good God, this stinks. Why did I go this way? Oh, that was- that was a poor choice. Poor choice, Bear Taffy. Okay. Let's see, a compass, that kind of makes up for it a little bit. Let's grab this extra 500 up here and blow that up. There we go. Yeah, a lot of missed opportunities yesterday, despite the still relatively good run, I'd say. I mean, I guess any hell run is a good run. Any run once you beat Yama is even better. But I did miss a couple of vaults inside. Oh my god! Well, thanks for watching the Daily Challenge. Holy crap! <laughs> Shit. Oh god. Oh, that's that's horrible. That's humiliating. Well, I think that was that was overdue. That was overdue. I am I'm a dummy. Should have checked. You did the same thing, Prince Baja. <laughs> okay. Damn. Well, let's not end there, huh? Let's go for a high score run. Let's go ahead and just play a regular adventure. Bring down Volcar with us again. Uh, I can't make a four minute video, man. Who am I, player Uno? Zing! Got him! Nah, I'll just go for a regular run here now. Well, that was disappointing. It's gonna bring my average down a little bit, isn't it? Oh my god. Should have gone with a robot. Yeah, damn right, Bearbot. That's the last time I'll make that mistake. I'll never doubt you again, Bearbot. I'll put it on YouTube, absolutely. This whole thing's gonna go on YouTube. People aren't even gonna realize what's happening when they've got like an hour and a half video from two runs spliced together and they're gonna be like, wow, Bear sure did do great on the daily challenge and then they're gonna find out later that I'm a liar. As they should have realized a long time ago. Mm-hmm. Well, at any rate. Let's grab Rufus after we can somehow manage to shimmy up here. There we go, that worked out. Probably should have checked that for a bomb, but you know, whatever. Throw caution to the wind. Who needs to be careful in Spelunky? That's silly. That's that's how you get $7,100 on the daily challenge, is you just act like an idiot. Man, I grabbed a compass, too. I can't, I can't dwell on it. That's gonna be... That's gonna be what brings me down. I gotta stay dapper, man. High spirits galore. I am ready to make something happen out of this run right here. I can do a ball and chain run. That kind of sounds like a good idea, actually. Maybe I'll do a ball and chain run. If, I, if I'm presented with the opportunity to do so, I think I will. Guess what? I finally reached the City of Gold, but I died against Old Mac Calf because I had no bombs. Oh, that's good, though, buddy. City of Gold was a freaking huge accomplishment for me, man. It says the line for you is, like, I finally made it, and you're like, damn right. Damn right, buddy. Ooh, hey, darkness level. Actually, kind of a welcome sight when you're not speed running and or concerned about your well-being. I'm sure a lot of you beat my daily score. <laughs> I've had worse, man. I've had worse, that's for sure. Alright, let's go ahead and drop this down here and set that off. There we go. 
thinking I'll probably go a bit on edge here now that we're not really concerned about too many things going awry. A couple scarab beetles I definitely want to grab here. Oh, oh my god, look at this. It's like a feast of them. It's fantastic. Alright. Oh my god, a vault. Oh, this is wonderful. Come here, buddy. Come here. Oh, you bastard. Come on. Don't run away. I don't want to have to use a rope to get you. Just, here, I'll let you, I'll let you float around for a bit and you can figure out what you're doing. Hey, Cobra. There we go. Oh my god, and we have an idol here too, and a shop which contains a bunch of bombs. This is so perfect. I don't want to crush them all though, so I'm probably going to have to go down there, do the shopkeeper whip trick, and then float myself back up with a couple ropes. Oh, come here, come here, come on! Oh my god, you're so close! Shoot! Alright, well, let's go do the whip trick real fast, and then we can get our uh, supplies in order. Ooh, hey, we actually have a giant spider here too. Let's go ahead and uh, get you killed real fast. I'm gonna get paced again, obviously, but I mean, like, it's better off that I get that guy killed than have to deal with him later. Hey, buddy! Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, God! Oh, I ruined it. <laughs> oh, those few little frames. Those few little frames, man. It's ridiculous. Oh, well. At least it wasn't the daily, right? <laughs> At least it wasn't the daily! Ah, oh, take solace in that. Alright, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I think I'm just gonna go... Go for some normal stuff again. Bearbot gives hugs like nobody's business. At least he should. I wish he would. I want him to. He will. One day. In your heart he does, of course. Let's see. Whip. For no reason. Rufus, my buddy! You're gonna come with me. Of course they're bear hugs. The best kind of hugs. Bear taffy hugs. For everybody. I want to break a million. I've been kind of thinking about that. I broke a million obviously in that one daily challenge. It was like, yeah, I don't even know what it was a long time ago now. This has been out for like a month, which is ridiculous to me. Seems like yesterday we we're doing the pre-release stuff and now it's all grown up. <laughs> Beautiful! Hi, Bear. I just bought Spelunky today. Cross Revert. Welcome to the rest of your life, my friend. Welcome to an absorption of your soul, and oh my good god. That's a beautiful shop. Let's see what we can manage to create out of that. I think I'd rather set them off some other way. Actually, you know what I could do? Since I'm gonna get a bomb box in there anyway, and I might even get a few bombs inside of this ch or, uh, not chest, inside of the crate, rather. Uh, I could do the rope glitch, yeah, that's something I should probably try out. There's some more ropes for me. There's our key, so we're gonna have to use a bomb to get that. That's. Have to use one to get that. Uh, I can get haste from this dude pretty easily, but I'd like to try. I actually don't know exactly how to do the. Oh god, that was unexpected. I don't know exactly how to do the rope glitch thing, so I'm not going to try that at the moment, but I am going to kill him. I'm going to redeem myself for the shotgun, the whip trick. Please don't die. Please don't die. Thank you. So I'm going to go like that, and then that should enable me to do this properly. Oh goodness. I don't know why I hesitate sometimes. I really shouldn't have even screwed it up as much as I did last time. I mean, like, it's kind of a simple thing once you get the hang of it, once you really know where you're going. It's just a matter of recollection, everybody. No problems anymore. We're gonna be fine. Alright. Wow, that was a good idea. You'd think I would have learned about blindly jumping into gaps of space that I don't know the occupants of by now, right? Oh well. I'm gonna get that shotgun. We'll have two hearts again, so at least we're not completely vulnerable to everything. Yeah, no dice. Should be able to get this money without doing that. There we go. Balance that rock precariously over there, and the next 500 bucks. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no problems from this point on. I promise. We'll be fine, Crazy Mike. Don't worry. 
Shoot Rufus in the face, that's poor advice. I would dispute that. Stand in the item right next to him, whip, go to the furthest item from him, and that's where the shotgun is. Ah. Oh, wait, you're talking about the shotgun trick. Yes. Oh, you're talking about the... Okay, main man is talking to me about the other trick, which is... Pick up an item, then put the rope so he does not get mad, and he is standing at the door, then you put a bomb next to him, and he won't flip out. That sounds about right. I think I tried it the last time, uh... Well, actually, it was probably yesterday when Red Panda Gamer and Misnap and I were all streaming. I'm just gonna shoot this guy a bunch of times. He goes through there. Should be dead now, and I didn't open the other one, but I should just be able to throw a bomb over to the other side here. Oh, whoops. That was not what I intended to do, but that'll work, too. I was trying to get those other two sapphires out, and I'd still like to do that. I don't know if it's worth a bomb still, but... Forget it, man! I'm doing it! Oh, there's a Matic down here, too. I totally didn't... Oh, my God, I only got one. I didn't even need to use those bombs. Well, I'd have to use one bomb, clearly, but... There's some more ropes, which are not really what I was looking for. Give me some bombs here. Give me some bombs! Yay! So happy. I right, set that off. Give myself some more money here. I probably should roll with the Matic, given the uh, desire I have to perhaps set a new high score here today, but it is a mystery whether or not I will. I may choose to bring the shotgun down here and try to kill the shopkeeper by maticking through somewhere like up in this area. Let's see if that's desirable. So we're obviously gonna hack that and that'll blow through like this. What I could do is jump Matic and go like that. And then I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try this. Just this is a silly idea, but I'm gonna try to make it work. I'm gonna jump Matic as soon as he's locked in here. Pick this up. Just start blasting through this little hole I've created for myself. And well maybe he'll jump up high enough one day. Uh, this this isn't really working very well, but it's kinda doing the trick. There we go. Okay, now we got ourselves started. Nice. All right, now we gotta get over to the other side real quick because the uh, ghost is gonna show up any second here. All right, so we killed him. Move quickly, quickly, quickly over to this end of the map. Hurry, 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 hurry. It's gonna be like right the hell now. Come on, baby. Give it to me, there we go. All right, sweet. He should be coming through the right side. She should be. Still guilty of that mistake. Over and over again. There we go. Ah, she blows. Ah, she blows. I have no idea what accent that was. It was disgusting. Despicable. Yes, you can jump and swing the Matic if you press both of them simultaneously. Much like a shotgun jump, which allows you to blast... Blast. Blast yourself up! Oh, God. Blast yourself up a couple extra spaces. You can do the exact same thing with the Matic and allow yourself to swing one space above you, which is pretty cool. All right, ghost lady, come on over this way. I'm gonna see if I can get you to go through that one. Indeed I can, that's fantastic. Everything's dead over here. I might be able to swing this. It's kind of a bad idea, kind of a bad idea, yep. Yeah. Oh, get that one. There we go, that's what I was hoping for. Okay, now, I think I am done here. I don't really wanna go over to the right side. I could bomb for a bit of extra cash, but I don't really think it's worth it. I'm just gonna grab it. Oh god, this is not a good idea. Crap, I'm gonna have to go all the way around again, shoot. Oh well. Worth it for 5Gs, am I right? What would you do for 5,000 bucks? Da da da! 144k at the start of 1-3, uh, I'm happy with that. Oh my god, I can't get myself out of here in time good lord that was testing the hitbox all right i'm gonna take the matic with me because i feel like i'll probably easily get a shotgun at some point in the future and i'm gonna hope that this pays off in the next level i'm gonna save the matic yeah why not matic for a ton of money is a good point but i'm hoping that i have the opportunity to make it even more profitable in the next level so i'm saving the extra hits on it for that reason oh uh, let's go ahead and just Drop that down there, just set that off really easy so I can grab this crate. Extra three bombs, I like it. 
And what do we got on the right side if I can freaking fit through the hole? I'm gonna push this over here. And that should open up some opportunities down that way. Let's see. That's probably worth it. So if I can find something to throw at this, probably an arrow down here that I can use for that. Dangerous game when you're throwing arrows at the TNT blocks, though, because they're like nine times out of ten just gonna blow right back in your face. So I gotta make sure I do this right. Thank you. Oh man, I easily could have gotten hit by that, but there we go. Oh man, I thought that was gonna blow up those other two. I can use a matic for that, I suppose. There are a lot of gemstones here, which is looking really, really solid for us. So let's make sure I exploit this heavily. I am very excited by the prospect of ghosting this, but I should clear up all these obstacles real fast. Just to make sure I'm not losing out on anything. I'm not going to grab that idle head just for the fact of the matter that I am likely to lose out on a lot of gemstones just by virtue of them being crushed by that evil, evil boulder. Let's see what happens here. I'm gonna get Rufus hopefully in the doorway because I am a little low on health and that concerns me slightly. Shopkeeper may very well fall on these spikes, so I should try to aggro him somehow. There he goes. All right. So, buddy, if you want to jump over here and, you know, he'll find his way down there eventually. I should check out the right side over here. I think I've got some good stuff. Dude, jump in those spikes, please, my friend. I need you to make that happen for me. Oh my god, alright, maybe if I stand up over here, I'll have a better go of it. Come on, shopkeep. Come on! Where's your good boy? Where's your good boy standing in the spice? It's so, so fun. No, he's not gonna do it, is he? Alright, maybe this is the best opportunity for it, but he's kinda locked where he's in again, too. Oh my god, come on! This is ridiculous! Jump properly! Come over here, look! Tantalizing meat, fresh for the taking! Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Alright, uh, wow, okay, well that sucks. I guess I'm gonna have to get started early. Screw Rufus, let's go start getting hit by spiders falling from the ceiling. Good lord, alright, I'm really screwing this up. Oh, I did that wrong too, let's see. Okay, you need to come over here, my beautiful lady. Get through that one first. Good, let's get you through these. Oh, come on, come on, there we go. Alright. Nice. And step right on up over here. Go get that second one. Get that second one. Nice. Beautiful. Okay. We can probably get this one pretty easily. Unless we can't. Ooh, God. Really got me close here. Alright, come on. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, this should be a bit easier to do now. Just go like this. And there we go! Beautiful. I want these ones up here too, so I'm gonna have to do the little jump trick. Like, the, oh, come on now. I should probably get it farther away just to give myself a little bit of breathing room here. Should be able to get this one as well, so let's go over here. I'm gonna have to drop down super quick as soon as I touch it, obviously. Man, I really hope that shopkeeper kills himself down there. Stovepipes, you're in love with my voice? I'm in love with you. A very nice thing to say, thank you. Wow, I'm a dumbass. All right, <laughs> unbelievable. Of all things, of all things. Well, Spelunky clearly has it out for me today, so this is not the time to play. Now I'm gonna switch over to the next game, which is gonna be Volgar the Viking again. This is just kind of gonna be a quick stream tonight, getting the daily challenge out of the way, as well as some good old-fashioned preview of a brutal game that's probably gonna make me even hate myself more than this did. Uh, stay tuned for a bit, guys. I'm going to take a quick break, play some chiptunes while I get things set up for you. Don't go anywhere. Bear Taffy Stream!